Hi, today we are in Golfmark 7 and I'm going to show you how to set up the memory of the high beam assist or dynamic light assist feature in your car. I'm not going to explain you um, explain to you what those features are, but if your car is equipped with a, a high beam assist camera over here in the uh, rear view mirror or is equipped with the camera for the lane assist or traffic sign assist, most likely you will have the high beam assist or dynamic light assist as well in your car. So over here in um, vehicle settings, lights, we can see that this car is equipped with dynamic light assist. And if I push the uh, right stalk forward, you can see that there's a uh, uh, indicator over here that uh, says that my high beams are now set to automatic. So um, the car based on the camera input will control my high beams and it will turn them on and off uh, when uh, uh, when required and um, that's it but if i turn off the ignition right now turn it back on start the car uh, you can see that the, um, uh, you can see that the assist the um, uh, light assist is no longer active and i had to enable it once again over here so the memory of the um, uh, light assist is off and right now I'm going to show you how to set it on. Over here I have the OBD11 application. I'm already connected to the car and I'm going to the modules list. Over here we are going to central electrics, which is module 09. We are going to adaptation. We are looking for channel call, uh, called uh, assistance light functions. And over here, there's a channel named uh, Fernlicht Assistant Reset and it's active. So the reset function is active and we want to deactivate it. So let's set it to not active, slide it, enter the um, security access code, which is 31347. It's over here in one of the uh, login prompts. So uh, let's set it up, success, and the adaptation was accepted by the car. And if I'm correct, right now we can disconnect from the car. If I'm uh, not mistaken, right now the assistant is on. And when I cycle the ignition, it should stay on. So let's check it out. Yes, it's still on. Okay, that's it for today. Give me a thumbs up if you like this simple tutorial and um, OBD11 instructions. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe for future ones and check my previous videos about Golf Mark 7 and other cars. See you soon.